Okay, kids, turn your Bible to Ephesians uh, 4, verse 26. Be angry and do not sin. Do not let the sun go down on your wrath. Christian, what does this verse say to us? Later. Much, much, much later. Later that night. Be angry and do not sin. Do not let the sun go down on your wrath. Sir, I wanted to apologize for yesterday. I forgive you. Thank you, sir. So I read this verse, Ephesians 4 verse 26, it says, um, be angry, do, but do not sin, do not let the sun go down in your wrath. And it confused me as to why it said, be angry. I was hoping you would um, help me understand why. Yeah, that's a great question. Um, the Bible, when it says, be angry, it is not, but do not sin. That is the important part, right? That's the okay. part we need to pay yeah. attention to. Because <laughs> yeah. even Jesus in scripture was angry yeah. when he... When he whipped the cattle out of the temple. Out of the temple because people were desecrating the temple. Okay. And yeah. he was angry, but he did not sin. It was a righteous anger. So how can we be righteously angry? Well, there's a bunch of different ways, but most prominently, we can be angry at the sin in the world, like Jesus was, but not sin while we're angry. So you're telling me we should love the sin and hate the sin? That's exactly what I'm saying. That's exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> What's going on, Angel? Focus in on the eye. 